We believe in a healthy, active lifestyle. We want to make products that help people perform their best. Features is a product that people appreciate what it does for them. You can see it in the design, but when you put it on your foot, it's something you can feel. This is a product that is at the highest level of quality. The goal is not some number, <laughs> certainly not a number of dollars, it's not a number of retailers, it's not even a number of consumers. It's becoming the most recognized performance sock brand in the world. So I spent 27 years in a family hosiery slash sock manufacturing company, and that company came to an end, and my three oldest children were in college, and so I had to figure out something to do differently pretty quickly. I was just visiting some malls and was noticing that the products that were at sports socks there in 2000 or the same ones that were there in, in the early 80s. And so the idea of a seamless toe that had a snug fit using fibers that formed to the foot seemed logical as the running in athletic footwear was developing and becoming more substantial. Kind of with that really simple concept started thinking about this. I knew a lot of independent reps in the marketplace, in the sports marketplace. So Dave was one of the guys that I knew from before. He, Dave lives in Ohio. And out of the blue, Hugh Gaither calls me uh, one morning and says, David, I've got, I think about getting back in the sock business. So I drove all the way down to Hickory. We met in the back of a small bank, local bank, because he didn't have an office. Didn't have a business at that time. We had, an, we had a concept, we had a business plan. And he puts this white sock on the table. I told Hugh point blank, Hugh, the world does not need another white sock company. Thank God he didn't listen to me. We're at Harris Covington Hosier Mill in High Point, North Carolina. They run our high performance products and our merino wool. The yarn's actually tied on back here on the yarn creel. It's fed through the tubes here that goes into the fingers of the machine. And here's the toe closure attachment where it does the stitch with stitch toe closure. What you're seeing up here is our original sock with a seamless toe, which no one had done at the time. I was 100% wrong. So this is our feature Charlotte office. We've been here for about six years. Uh, I think when we first moved in, there were four of us. My dad started to, he was developing prototypes. Uh, I was just out of college. I remember he was trying to get feedback and I think initially I wasn't very encouraging and I grabbed a pair of the prototypes. That was the moment where I said, okay, maybe Maybe there's something here. It was fun and exciting to talk to my dad and brother about the business and follow the growth and the development of the brand. Joe's always had, a, had great creative instincts. He was the one that came up with the name Features. My dad tells the story about when he came home with his business plan and he wanted to come up with a name that conveyed the features and benefits of the product. And Joe, without looking up from the homework he was doing, just said features, F-E-E-T-U-R-E-S. Wow, that might work. It just popped into my head instantly. I saw it visually. And here we are today, 19 years later. It's funny, I think this might be one of my first outdoor retailer shows. And then you can see here how the booth changed. This is after I took over marketing and sort of the evolution <laughs> from. It's a privilege to be able to work with my dad and brother. The camaraderie you have when you're building something that you're passionate about, um, you know, sometimes that leads to heated discussions. Hugh likes to say spirit, spirited conversation breaks out. All three Gaithers are sort of spread strategically throughout the office. Um, two in one workstation would probably be combustible. We've realized that, that uh, being respectful of each other's opinions, working to achieve a consensus on important decisions and strategies and things like that have, have been important. And critical to our success. We're at MSC, where they do a lot of testing for us. Okay, we're uh, setting up here for an abrasion test on our products, where we can check to see how long it takes to wear a hole in the product. All this testing is done to ensure that the consumer is getting the best product they can get. One of the things that we had been doing all along, in addition to trying to be innovative with the product, was being supportive with our retail customers. 
Hey, how's it going? Hey, good to see you. Nice to see you. Yeah. Are you guys tracking your shoe to sock ratio? We are. We're doing about two to one right now. That's amazing. So, they've always been super supportive of our business, whether it's coming in and helping us with events, helping tech our staff on how to sell more product. I didn't realize that the running specialty market was going to be this sort of incubator for our brand and was going to be growing healthily in this time period. We knew high performance was a great product, but we also felt like there was an opportunity to develop an even better product. We sort of started working with our manufacturing partner and around that idea. And eventually they brought us a prototype based on that feedback. That had what we today call targeted compression in the arch of the foot. And because they're left and right, it's in the medial portion of the arch. And it really created a, a, a point of separation for features that we had never ha had before. We worked for a year and a half, two years before it was actually ready to roll out to the market. But I think we, we knew enough when we saw that first prototype to think we maybe had something, something big there. When we introduced the product at the running event, which is a big trade show for running retailers, it was a really big deal. We had a big booth for the first time. We were all really confident on what we had to deliver to the market. We had a name. We had created some excitement with the marketing. So everybody was coming up sort of asking us about Elite. What is this? What are you unveiling? Retailers reacted almost instantly. The reaction was extremely positive and extremely favorable. It really helped solidify our position in the market as a leader in sock technology. This is called the Shimaseki Apex Design System, so it allows me to design very accurately, stitch by stitch. Therefore, we're able to cut down the development time. For us, we're completely focused on socks. That's all we do. And so I think that gives us an advantage because we wake up every day focused on trying to figure out ways to make socks better. Yeah, so this is our latest decoded collection. It's left, right specific. And then, of course, our targeted arch compression, full mesh zone at the entire top of the foot. I love being able to hear these like great testimonials from consumers. It really drives what I do. I feel like having a purpose, building a product that actually makes a difference in someone's life. My toes are happy, my feet are happy. It's almost like they're being hugged by the sock. No blisters at all. And I'm kind of blown away, I guess, by the fit. We have a passionate, loyal following. They'll literally start to approach anyone in the booth and they'll take off their shoe to show that they're wearing features. And it happens all day long. She's got her features on! Get out of here! <laughs> From the beginning, there's, there's been a focus on taking care of the customer. That focus, that attention to detail is so important for our brand. The commitment that we have to making sure that they have a good experience, as much as anything, that's probably been the thing that I learned from my dad. It speaks to our mission of developing products to help people achieve their personal best. That's what makes what we do worthwhile.